Do you want mama to sit? Do you need help? Today it is finally feeling like fall and so Gray has on his new puffy vest and I have my vest on too so we're matching. I don't know how much longer I'll be able to do that with him getting older but we are matching with our vests. Anthony is inside with Porter right now. Um, today is Anthony's last day off of work for paternity leave. He really didn't get paternity leave, so he had to take vacation time, and he just took two weeks of vacation. So today's the last day. He goes back to work tomorrow. Thankfully, he is going to be working from home, so he will just be upstairs. So I won't feel totally alone, but I am a little scared about how tomorrow's going to go. Yeah, as you can see, it is definitely fall. The leaves are starting to fall from our tree. And I hate, I hate this. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love fall. It's my favorite season. I love football, the cold weather, sweatshirts, jeans, um, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Like, I love fall. But our yard has all these trees, which is amazing in the summer because we have so much shade when it's so hot out and it's perfect. Like usually in the afternoons, we are almost totally shaded because we have so many trees. We have this big tree, we've got this big tree, we've got this tree, and we've got this tree. And we also have these trees over here. So it's awesome. We have all these, all this coverage. The bad part about having that many trees is in the fall when all the leaves fall because our yard, our backyard really, it's not even the front yard, it's just the backyard, gets completely covered with leaves. And it gets so bad that it usually takes like a good weekend to fully rake all the leaves. And last year I ended up raking all the leaves myself because Anthony had to go on a business trip to Japan and so I ended up doing it myself and I barely got it all in. Um, I waited until like right before Thanksgiving to do it, which was crazy. And it had already frosted, all the leaves were sticking together. It was a mess, I was freezing. And we end up, every year we end up bagging almost like 20 bags of leaves. Like that's how much it is. So I'm not looking forward to that. It looks really pretty right now with all the leaves on the ground. Like that's really cute. And it's fun to rake them up and Grayson jumps in the leaves. And so that's super fun, but I hate raking them up. It is not fun at all, right? <laughs> yeah, are you swinging? So yeah, I haven't filmed much lately. I think Anthony and I have just been trying to, well, really me, I've just been trying to get into like a routine now that we have two kids. And it's been kind of hard the last two weeks because I'm not, I wasn't able to like go up and down the stairs a lot of times because they wanted me to rest. And so Anthony had to do a lot. And so I just didn't film very much, but I'm hoping to get back into it now that Anthony's going back to work, just kind of getting back into a routine. It will definitely be harder because I'll have two kids now. And it's like two on one, I'm outnumbered, but um, Grayson's just learning that he needs to be patient and wait his turn. And Porter has to learn that too, even though he's an infant and can't really learn that. But everything's going good so far. I'll get some cute footage today of Porter for you guys. He is awesome. He's already on a schedule. Um, the first couple nights home from the hospital, he was up a lot of the night and that's just typical because usually their mornings and nights are mixed up. But then after about one or two nights home, he got back on his schedule. And so now he sleeps, I mean, he sleeps through the night, but not really, I mean, he wakes up. I wake up um, two times throughout the night with him. And so that's actually really, really good. Sometimes I wake up three times, but two or three times, that's usually how many times. And I'll wake up, I'll change his diaper, swaddle him, feed him, and then he goes right back down. I put him back in the bassinet and he goes right back to sleep. It's awesome. So he's been doing really, really good at night. Um, Anthony's been super awesome and has been letting me sleep in in the mornings. Um, unfortunately, that is coming to an end because he's going back to work, but it was nice while it lasted. 
So it'll just be a new normal of trying to figure out my day-to-day -day activities with two kids instead of one. Stick. You want a stick? I don't know. Do we have some sticks? One stick. Okay, I'll look. So Grayson is obsessed with Halloween and he is obsessed with these Halloween books. His favorite one right now is <laughs> Fright Night Flight. Uh, but he is also obsessed <laughs> with, oh, it's on the floor back here. The Night Before Halloween, which sounds just like um, The Night Before Christmas, um, but it's Halloween themed. And then he's obsessed with this one too. It's a little lady oh, who is not afraid of anything. Oh. And he just loves all these Halloween books and we read them over and over and over oh. again. Once upon a time, there was a little old lady who was not afraid of anything. For some reason, he calls this book Pumpkin Man, but there's no, I mean, I guess there's like a pumpkin scarecrow that comes at the end, but most of it's a little old lady. But he is loving Halloween, which I guess is better than Christmas since we are at the end of September now. He takes forever to turn the page, though. <laughs> All right, praise Jesus. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> And he's reading Good a book. Good night, Goon. Good night, Martian. Good night, Martian. Good night, Martian's taking over the moon. This is one of his other favorite books. Good it's night, actually Martian. a parody Good of Good Night, um, Good Night Moon, the classic Good book. Night. This is called Good Night Goon, and so it's kind of like a monster stylized version of that. And Gray loves this book. And back to Porter, he is two weeks old now, and this is actually a zero to three month outfit. And yes, this used to be Grayson's. I'll have to see if I can find a picture of him wearing this when he was just a little baby. Oh, be nice. Gray likes to give Porter moral spasms, but it's not very nice, Grayson. But he, Porter is doing really well. He was actually cluster feeding today. And he was cluster feeding last night. He must be going through a growth spurt. Because, man, he is eating a ton. Oh, <coughs> Grayson, no, no. Don't touch Porter. Gosh, this is what I deal with. Um, so, yeah, he's been eating a lot. He's been sleeping a lot. He's usually just awake about four hours of the day. The rest of the time he sleeps. And he's pretty easy. And nights have been going really well. Yeah. And yeah, this is just our days. We read books, we play in the playroom, and Porter just sleeps. <laughs>